My name is, My name is Manuela Santop. I work for the State Authority for Citizens and Regulatory Affairs, and I'm the project leader tasked with introducing the new identity cards in Berlin. As a result of new legislation, we now need four declarations from residents for each application. Since on average 400,000 applications are received in Berlin every year, this means we have to contend with about 1.6 million pieces of paper. We are required to keep these statements from residents for 10 years, the length of time for which an identity card is normally valid. This would mean that over the course of the next 10 years, we will have to file and archive as many as 16 million pages. To put this in perspective, if you laid 16 million pages end to end, they would reach from Berlin to New York. In Berlin, we have completed a project with 46 regional citizens' offices. This included introducing new hardware in Berlin. Among these hardware items is a signature tablet. We're working with the Federal Printing Office. With regard to the new identity cards, we can only use devices that have been referenced or certified by the Federal Printing Office for the new card application procedure and for communication. Vacom was one of the first manufacturers to receive this certification. The tablet is nice and slim, but also very sturdy, and with its large input surface, we can capture nearly all of the signatures we need, whether your handwriting is small or large, or if you have a long or short name, so it works very well for our purposes. The customer visits us at the citizen's office, then goes to the administrative assistant and presents his biometric photo. We then enter the application data that is the applicant's family name, given names, height, eye color, and he signs the application. We make the statement appear on the citizen's monitor and his signature is then captured electronically with the tablet. Next year, we are going to correct a minor flaw regarding the application check page. Because of time constraints, we have not been able to generate this page electronically. But next year, we will be able to display it and also have it signed using the tablet. We launched this project in March of 2010 and made a pinpoint landing, as it were, on November the 1st with the introduction and issue of the first identity cards. In future, the tablet will help us considerably as we work towards the paperless office, and we will undoubtedly put it to other uses.